As seen on Sunny Space's official website, both fluff mats and air blushes are multi-purpose products that can be used on the eyes, cheeks, and lips. Since both of them have similar functions, that got me wondering which product performs better and which product is the better purchase? Well, let's find out in this video. Hey ya, it's your girl Buya, and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, your girl will be comparing Sunny Space's Fluff Matte and their newest release, the Air Blush, and we'll see which product is worth it. A little disclaimer, this comparison video is based on my thoughts and opinions. We may or may not share the same opinions, but all I ask is respect and a healthy conversation down in the comment section below. Without any more further ado, let's proceed to the breakdown. First up, let's compare the product details of Fluff Matte and Air Blush. So first up is Fluff Matte. So Fluff Matte's product description is, it is a weightless modern matte lipstick formulated with a silk structure technology to give you that second skin feel. Each shade is designed to be universally flattering and easy to apply with one quick swipe. Next up we have is the Air Blush. So the Air Blush is a soft focus, sheer cheek tint with a silky matte finish. The ultra fine pigments blend seamlessly onto your skin for a filtered flush. It comes in six buildable shades you can use on your cheeks, eyes, lips, nose, anywhere you want a little color. So in both of these descriptions, they have very similar claims. For the air blush, it has a silky matte finish. And then the fluff matte is a matte lipstick formulated with a silk structure technology, which is basically saying that it has a silky matte texture to it. Now moving on, both of these products are multi-purpose and they're also paraben and cruelty free. The fluff matte retails for 345 pesos each. Meanwhile, the air blushes retail for 445 pesos each. Therefore, the fluff mat is cheaper by 100 pesos. Next is the fluff mats contain 3.2 grams of product. Meanwhile, the air blushes contain 2.5 grams of product. Therefore, the fluff mat contains 0.7 grams more product. Therefore, you'll be getting more product and save 100 pesos with fluff mats. Yun nga lang, since the fluff mats are bullet type lipsticks, they don't come with a mirror compared to the air blushes. So if you want a pan type cheek tint that comes with a mirror, then go for the air blushes. So by the way guys, this is what the packaging looks like of the air blush. It's a really cute box and then at the back of the box, it has a swatch of the shade, like a blended swatch of the shade. For the actual product packaging, this is what it looks like. It's a monochromatic packaging. Again, really cute. So kung ano yung shade ng air blush, yan rin yung color ng compact case. At first glance, it really looks creamy and I like the packaging because it's travel friendly. Actually, mas heavy pa nga yung original packaging ng fluff matte when I weigh both of them and mas may weight to. Yung issue ko sa air blushes though is that it doesn't come with a brush or like something to scoop out the product. I feel like it's kind of unhygienic to keep on dunking your finger sa pan. And when you keep dunking it on something that's creamy, the bacteria and dirt is gonna store there. That's one thing that I don't like about this one. So anyway, I'll be swatching the fluff matte and air blush on my face. So for fluff matte, I'll be using the shade Girl Crush. And for the air blush, I'll be using the shade Moon. By the way guys, hindi ako magko-compare ng shades or ng pigments. What I'll be doing right now is just comparing the performance of the two products.
Okay, so having tried the two products, what I can say is I like the fluff matte's performance on the cheeks. For some reason, the air blush removed my foundation and concealer. I had to retouch my foundation and concealer and reapply this. To think na ito dapat mas nag remove ng makeup ko, kasi ito mas dry siya or mas matte siya talaga compared sa air blush. So the fluff matte didn't remove my foundation nor concealer, but the air blush did. On the eyes, the man they perform very similar to each other. For the lips naman, yung pag-apply ko kanina ng fluff matte is how I would normally apply a bullet lipstick on my lips. Therefore, mas mabigat siya kasi mas thicker yung application niya. Kasi straight from the bullet yung application. Compared naman sa air blush, since ginamit ko yung finger ko, it doesn't have any weight at all. But it does have a texture. When I press my lips together, it does have a texture but it doesn't have a weight which is really nice because usually of my texture there's some kind of weight but the air blush doesn't it has a similar texture to the fluff matte but more sheer sha I think I can get a similar effect na binibigay ng air blush with the fluff matte if I just dab on the product lightly and spread it with my fingers I think I can get that similar effect that air blush gives for the longevity guys I cannot speak much about it because I'm not doing a wear test today sadly I'm sorry <laughs> by the way guys Guys, before we proceed to the conclusion and final verdict, if you like this type of content, then please do subscribe to my channel. It will really help this channel grow. And of course, please do follow me on my Instagram account. It's at Makeup by Buya. I do updates there regarding the longevity of a product. You can message me, ask me a question regarding makeup or life. I don't know, beauty, anything you want to. So go ahead and please check out my account. It's at Makeup by Buya. So for my conclusion, and final verdict, I really like air blush because napakagaan niya sa face. Wala talaga siyang bigat any who, any whatsoever sa face. So if you want that, then this is super nice for you. Again, yung downside lang niya, it costs 445 pesos and again, it's pretty unhygienic. You have to have clean hands every time you dunk your finger sa pan because you don't want dirt and bacteria sa air blush ninyo. So that's something that you have to keep in mind. Also compared sa fluff matte, it costs 100 pesos more. But you'll be getting naman a mirror. If worth it yung price para sa inyo, then go for it. I really really like this product. I really like the effect on the lips. But if you'll ask me if alin sa dalawa yung pipiliin ko, I will have to go for the fluff matte because it is 100 pesos cheaper guys and it contains more product and it is way more hygienic compared to a pan type tint. Also guys, with the fluff matte, pwede siyang thick application and pwede siyang thin application. Therefore, I can also achieve the air blush effect sa eyes, lips, and cheeks ko with the fluff matte. It just really depends on how you apply it on your face. It's just that yung mga colors na available sa air blush, hindi siya available sa fluff matte. Yun lang yung down side niya. But if you're a big fan of Sunny's face and you really want to try out the air blush, just go for it if you have that extra coin to spare. <laughs> anyway guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope I helped you guys in your decision making process and I hope you learned something today and if you did then please do like this video and share it and of course again please do subscribe to my channel and follow my Instagram account. It's at Makeup by Buya. If you have any more comments or video suggestions, then please do enter them down in the comment section below. Just remember, no hate, just love.